Hello everyone, I am Rohit and welcome to the second part of things you need to know about Python string. So without doing any delay, let's get started. So guys, in previous video, we all see to create a string and store our string in a particular variable called my string. In today's video, I am going to explore some other feature about string. So I can comment it out or I can make a new heading for new heading. I just convert my cell to code to heading and I naming as some features about strings. So guys we write our first program that is hello world so we print it again hello world and for getting output in Jupyter notebook I have to press a shift enter then my hello world is get executed and you can see output over here but what if I want a world word on a new line therefore I have to use a backslash n in between hello and in between world so you just follow this method just hello after that backslash n and world so guys you can see over here the word after that backslash n is on a new line so by using a backslash n you can write you, your word on a new line so i just created another string for more intuition just created hello backslash backslash n world backslash ai era so you can see over here the world and ai era is on new line so the backslash n will transfer the word on a new line after that if we want a space between hello world instead of n we have to use a backslash t that is hello backslash t and world if i executed this code with backslash t you can see over here white space in between hello and world so this two feature is not often used but as a python developer or a, if we are going to learn this language then you should know about this two feature and the next is about slicing i can comment it out over here slicing in slicing we can see that the slicing we have to give a start point stop point and a step so i can grab this variable again and copy from there and paste it over here and it again created an example and if I want to reverse the whole string then I just have to write I in that square bracket I did not want to mention a start position a end position in, and uh, at step I have to mention a minus one a minus one will provide me a reverse string you can see over here here string start from a and here string will start from h so these three topics that I am forgot to add that my in last video so therefore I created this new video and hopefully you like this video so if you like this video share with your friend do subscribe my youtube channel and thank you one and all